there, I'm Jack and it's Tuesday, May 17th. Welcome to Netlink Daily. This is usually part of the show where a weird intro monologue is done, but I couldn't think of anything, so rain check. To the news. If you have visited any tech-related websites today, you would know that the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1080 reviews have all been posted. Except from this channel, because we didn't get our hands on one. Anyways, to no one's surprise, the benchmarks all reveal that the GTX 1080 is both good on paper and in real life. The car barely breaks a sweat during the 1080p benchmarks, but the GTX 1080 really shines in 1440p, 2160p, and with VR content. Even for games on DirectX 12 show great results. So basically, if you didn't think the GTX 1080 wasn't going to meet your expectations, well, you were wrong. But now that the reviews and benchmarks are out, how many of you will be picking up a brand new GTX 1080? Leave a comment down below. Google has unveiled a new special camera. It's called the Art Camera. What is the Art Camera? Well, it's a custom-built camera capable of capturing gigapixel images very quickly. The Art Camera's main purpose is to preserve the world's art by bringing it online for users to see. The camera is so powerful, you can zoom in on the image to see the brushstrokes of a painting. Google will be sharing the first thousand images captured by the Art Camera on the Google Cultural Institute website, where you can see famous works of art from such artists as Van Gogh, Monet, Rembrandt, and so on. There are only 20 art cameras, and no, they aren't for sale. Or be used for selfies. Neither of those things. Speaking of Google, former Google employees have banded together to start their own self-driving technology company called Auto. Oto? Oto. Auto. But Auto isn't developing for regular automobiles. They are concentrating on large vehicles like semis. Auto's developments would be fitted into trucks that are already on the road now instead of designing all new trucks that drive autonomously. Auto says that they have already completed one public highway demo of its system. Man, all I can think of is that one episode of The Simpsons where Homer becomes a trucker and then finds out about the Navitron auto drive system. And then he... Anyways, but let's face it. All the self-driving cars are just going to become Transformers, robots in disguise. Or at least I'm hoping so. It's been a while since we've done a classic version, so... <coughs> Lightning round. That felt good. Microsoft will be recycling a million Xbox gamer tags for 24 hours starting tomorrow, May 18th. This might be a good time to get rid of that 420 Blaze at 69 you made when you were 8. Or not. Whatever. Waverly Labs will be launching an earpiece that will allow people to converse in two different languages at the same time and still be able to understand each other. G-Skill has five new colors for their Trident Z DDR4 RAM modules. Interesting. Might have to get that for my new build. Nintendo wants to make movies, according to Japanese newspaper Asahi News. Id Software might be looking into rebooting the Quake franchise, according to a job posting on the ZeniMax Media website. And finally, Razer will be opening up its first physical store in the US this Saturday, May 21st in San Francisco. Sources for all of today's news stories can be found in the NCX forum post linked down below. Hey, loco! Están todo borracho aquí! You know, sometimes I think Spanish comes a lot easier to me than Cantonese or even French. But you know what else comes pretty easy? It's the NCIX newsletter Subscribe and Win. This month's Sub and Win prize is a Gigabyte GTX 960 4 gig version with a WinForce cooler. All you have to do is sign up for the weekly newsletter by checking the link down below and you're entered to win. If you're already signed up for our newsletter, then all you have to do is redeem your NCIX newsletter points and you're entered as well. This is only open to the US and Canada, so sorry, and some other conditions do apply. But huge thanks to Gigabyte for providing this month's prize. Click here or the link down below for more details. All right, that's it for Netlink Daily. Thank you so much for watching. Click over here for previous videos and check us out on social media right over here. But as always, don't forget to like the video, comment down below for fans with benefits, and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. Now, if you excuse me, I need to start my shopping list for my new computer. See ya.